New this morning, another federal lawsuit has been filed against Baton Rouge police. A Baton Rouge husband and wife say they were illegally detained and arrested and then taken to the Brave Cave, a police substation that has since been ordered closed. John Rapolo has more details. And this shows the pattern of behavior uh, within this unit during this time. Baton Rouge attorney Ron Haley filed this 11-page federal lawsuit against several BRPD officers in the city of Baton Rouge Friday on behalf of his clients, Alex Woods and Rose Carter. Haley says officers with BRPD Street Crimes Unit conducted a drug raid at his client's Clayton Street home in August of 2023, but hit the wrong house. They overheard officers say that they hit the wrong house. If you look at the police report, they wound up going to the adjacent house. According to that police report we obtained, officers did enter two homes that day. They were next to each other, but there is no mention of a mistake. BRPD alleges drugs and illegal weapons were found inside Woods and Carter's home. Haley says the evidence was planted to cover up raiding the wrong house. They were seen bringing boxes between the houses back and forth, almost to try to clean up and justify um, their wrongdoing. Woods claims one of his dogs was shot while in a kennel and says he was beaten after being detained outside of his home. Woods and Carter were taken to the now-closed Brave Cave, a police substation. The city shut down the facility after allegations of illegal strip searches and beatings. Both claimed they were illegally strip searched. That policy was ruled unconstitutional last month by a federal judge. Carter says she was strip searched by male officers. They made me take off my clothes. They told me to bend over and cough like two or three times. I just felt embarrassed. Carter says she wasn't charged and was let go. Twelve former and existing BRPD officers are named in the lawsuit and former Chief Murphy Paul. Some of the officers have been disciplined by the Van Rouge Police Department for other incidents. 